Another day, another message from the Lord. He's placed this into my heart to share with you today. And he said to me to tell you, go out and tell my people that they're out there worrying and stressing about something they shouldn't even be worrying or stressing about. They are out there fighting battles that are not even theirs because I, the Lord, will fight the battle for them. How many of you are now stuck in some sort of situation and it feels like all odds are against you? and you just don't know what else to do you don't know how to get out of it you don't know how to get through it and you're struggling because you're fighting with it but then you seem like you can't get anywhere well god wants to remind you that god never intended for you to carry the weight of your own provision god never intended for you to worry about anything how this will be or how or when this will come about god never intended for you to have anxiety and to overstress and to overthink and most importantly the battle is not even yours. So why are you sitting there fighting a battle that's not even yours? And he told me to give you this scripture specifically, which is found in 2 Chronicles chapter 20 and verse 15. He said, Listen, King Jehoshaphat and all who live in Judah and Jerusalem. This is what the Lord says to you. Do not be afraid or discouraged of this vast army, for the battle is not yours, but God's. He said that to Jehoshaphat when he was going through a battle and there seems like a vast army in front of them. And he wanted his people not to let fear into their heart, but to remain in faith. Because when you are in faith, you are operating from the power of God. And so he is telling you, no matter what the odds are against you, do not be afraid of what you see out here. And do not be discouraged because the battle is not yours, but the Lord's. And let me tell you something about God. And here is a, what, what, what do we call it? Um, a spoiler alert. God has never lost a battle and God will never lose a battle. If the battle is God's, then you already know that victory is yours and triumph is already yours. It's already done. Now sit back and watch it unfold in divine manner and timing.